But uh, good morning, everybody. Thanks for coming. See, we started in 1987. We have four plants. Two are what we call wet plants. We went through a lot of transition. I mean, it was just, when can we run this? When can we run that? There's still a few old timers around here that will tell you we used to run 100% efficiency. You know, I had all the pieces around us in place. I had the people. We just weren't working together. So when we first started with Red Zone, we were 40% OEE. Days now when we're hitting 80, the trucks can't keep up. We have to shut lines down because we can't get product out of the building fast enough. I mean, our OEE has gone up, but a good indicator that goes along with it to say that, yeah, our OE number is actual is what, over a year and a half ago to now, we're shipping, uh, what, a million to a million and a half more pounds per week out of this facility with less headcount. We haven't increased hours. I remember the first week that my guys crossed 50%. I shut down the lines and went and shook everybody's hand. You recognize that they're doing something good and it means a lot to them. And that's always important. As you talked about just that taking, people take pride. They never want to come in and not do well. You give them the tools to do well, you give them the feedback that they are doing well, and we go from there. And so what we saw value in is we needed a system that could be functional, meaningful and usable uh, at the tip of the spear. We needed some systems that both afforded uh, greater collaboration so our folks could make better decisions right there at the moment of use. And then when they, they see the, the results that are coming from this and, and the benefits it gives them, it was one, one step after the next, just building blocks. Our culture's coming back now.